Hey, good morning, 845. Uh, a couple things with today's workout. After going through two classes today, the 5 a.m. and the 6 a.m., we've run into some log jams and a lot of different questions about what's going on with this workout. The scaled version, RX athletes or RX athletes are going to do it as prescribed. The scaled version of this has jumping chest to bar pull ups in it. A lot of athletes are having a tough time with this jumping chest to bar pull up and they cannot do it. All right. But they can do the 45 pound thruster or the 65 pound thruster. So what you would do is this. You would do your 45 or 65 pound thruster. That gives you a score. 10 thrusters at the RX weight, but your tie break time would be 15 minutes. So that'll give you a score for the workout, right? But we can't do anything else. So we're not going to stand around for 14 and a half minutes doing the rest of the workout. So we're not doing the rest of the workout. So what we're going to do is this. You do your 10 thrusters, and then we break out into a whole separate workout. We have the foundations version, which is PVC or barbell thruster. In part one, you do a bent over row with a barbell. For the second portion of that, it's the same PVC or barbell thruster, except the weight, you could add weight, 35 pounds, 45 pounds, or you could stay with a PVC. It doesn't matter. It's your choice. The part two gymnastics would be a push-up. It doesn't have to be a push-up. You could still do a barbell row if you choose to, all right? If you want a whole separate workout, like the open doesn't even exist for you right now, all right? It's nice to see it. We went through it. We looked at it, and we decided that, hey, we can't do much of this workout, and that's okay, but we still want to get a good workout in today. What we're going to do is this. You're going to do your 10 thrusters, RX. Your tie break time will be 15 minutes, all right? That's the score you will enter in the CrossFit Open. But then we want to get a good workout in, so we're going to do five rounds. We're going to do 10 thrusters. Choose any weight, whatever you think is good. We're going to hit all the standards. We're going to get below parallel, and we're going to choose any weight. Then we're going to do jumping pull-ups. A lot of people have jumping pull-ups, but they don't have jumping chest to bar. So we're going to do those jumping pull-ups, all right? We're going to rest a minute like we would if we were doing the, the open, and then we're gonna do five more rounds of 10 thrusters. Again, any weight. If you wanna increase the weight, you can. You can stay at the same weight. It doesn't matter. Maybe this first portion gassed you a lot. You could even go lighter than you did in the first portion and get your five rounds in on the second portion. Get your 10 thrusters, and again, we're gonna go with jumping pull-ups for that. Oh, sorry. We're going to make that seven. So it's 10 and 10 in the first five rounds, and we'll go seven and seven in the second five rounds. All right? Good luck. We'll see you.